What are all the responsibilities that you have as a mom? I have working with kids at school, getting the kids ready for school, mm -hmm. getting my sister to get to the gymnastics, then my teddy to go back to sleep and take a nap, then I have to work for all night. You have to work all night? What about what about um your dad or your husband? Does he help? He does nothing around the house. Nothing around the house? No. I she told me to do it so much. His is in my dad's. So she made me do all that stuff then. I do my stuff, but I don't know what he's doing with me. Well, does he make the meals? Does he cook your dinner? I took my own and he took his, but I he doesn't let me do it when I'm out when when I'm out with him. When Who cooks for the kids? I do, and sometimes my husband does. And when husband when my husband not wait, I made my own dinner. <laughs> what else do do you have to do? You have to get everybody ready to go to gymnastics and a meeting gymnastics and homework and do homework then do on practice then practice on with my homework then do rest of my book homework thing then get the kids ready for bed then get me ready for bed and then my husband to do Things then he does it, then I do all the things, and he does it, make me do it. Things you make me do, cleaning the house up. He doesn't uh, help with that? No. What does he, just he do? He makes me do stuff. It's his job and my job. Oh, man. And he does nothing wrong. I have to sleep sometimes and take a nap. Hmm. I don't know what he's doing that for. I don't know. He doesn't sound like a very good husband. It's a visible husband. Right, invisible, yeah. And I don't know what he's doing. I know. And she's to S, and his name is J. Okay. And I don't know what he's doing. And then I tell him what to do. Then I do nothing around the house. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. How do you take care of yourself? I take care of myself taking the pills and then medicine, taking rest and eating good food and getting the kids ready to go like kind of to a fun day to a zoo. That's wonderful. You sound like an amazing mom. But my husband have to drive me there. But I don't know myself as my own car. Yeah. And he at work and yeah. stuff. Yeah, because you have your own car. Yeah. Yeah. Her name is Firebomb and she's red and she has fire on her. You have a car named Firebomb? Yeah. That's amazing. She has fire stripes on it. I love it. All and, moms need to have a fierce and, car named Firebomb with fire stripes on it. And my last thing, I have a blue car and her name is Osa Blue. That's a great and name. She has Frozen stuff. So, I don't like this husband of yours. I think you should have a husband that should help you more. But I still like him. Why? I don't know. What do you like? What do you like about him? I just liked about him helping me give him hugs and stuff. Yeah. We get hugs together. Yeah. But he's not here right now. He's at right. work. Okay. Does he make you laugh? He made me laugh when he tittered me. <laughs> that's that's funny. Like tittered me on my face. Then oh. it tittered so funny. Mm. Does he bring you flowers? He bring me flowers like every morning maybe? That's great. Every, every morning? Every sunny morning. Does he give you foot rubs? He give me foot rubs when it's all cold days. Yeah. Because I like when he did foot rubs when it's cold days. And I give foot rubs to my children when it's sunny days. Okay. 
Dad. Does, he, does he dance with you in the kitchen? Sometimes he does. Sometimes we just... Sometimes I fall, then he picks me up. That's nice. If I felt before he just like come back so fast and he just puts me up. That's good. Back where I am, cause I don't want to fall more backwards. So that's why right. then sometimes he carries me, like he carries me and. Does he like to do the same things you like to do? He does the same thing what he's supposed to do. Like what? What is he supposed to do? He's supposed to be nothing. Oh, okay. He does nothing then. I do a whole house working around. A woman's job is never done. And he makes me doesn't go to a ball. And he doesn't make me go anywhere. You don't get to go to the ball? I don't want to go to the Uder because I just, sometimes he gets to go with a children. And I never, ever want to clean your house again. I know. You should hire somebody to help clean your house. But I, but my husband cleans all the dinner up. Oh, well, that's good. So you cook and he cleans? Yeah. That's a, that's a good balance. Sometimes I cook, sometimes he cooks. And then um, when he cooks, do you clean the dishes? I sometimes I clean dishes. And at night... I'll go to football, and he makes me do everything during football. Wow. And he makes me do basketball, high chips. I don't know what he's doing that for for me. He's just a nice man to me, but I just don't like his attitude for me. You don't like his attitude? Because he does nothing, and I talk on the phone every night. What is that for? I don't know. So, I clean the dishes every morning and night instead. When I have breakfast, I clean one dish to them. It was one dish. Okay. Then, I read a book to the children and get them all ready for bed. What is that? I wish husband did that. I'm ready for bed because I'm tired of standing in the house I'm sitting. Yeah, so, you should be tired. You've been working really hard. And I have something kind of really special. Really, I like really special things. I'm really, really boring. What's really boring? To take a dog outside and feed him. Yes, you have a dog to take care of as well? Yeah. And I don't know why you have two dogs. Two dogs? And how many children do you have? Like, one is my American Turtle, two is Turkey, my Builder Bear, three is Violet, four is Rainbow. Five kids is a lot. Six is Ariel. Seven is another Elsa. What am I after? Eight. Nine. Nine is Rapunzel. Then up another one. Then up an Anna. Then another Elsa. Then a baby. Oh my gosh. That's too many children to take care of by yourself. And a baby. A baby, yeah. So that's why I have so many, and I don't know why he has slippers for her, and he has Buddha Bear shoes, and Buddha Bear these for my Buddha Bear. But that goes sleeping now, so in a room, and now. Now is it time for you to have a cup of tea? Yeah. Maybe read. Maybe, maybe read a book, take a relaxing bubble bath. Yeah, I just took one already. Oh, good. It's like it had water in it and it had bubbles. I took one with Violet yesterday. I got her all clean. Great. I didn't come in a bath with her, well, I just got her a bath. Great. We need a boot of a bath. You seem like a really great mom. You work really but hard. But I'm still a sister. 
mom does stuff around the house too. Like yeah. me. Yeah. She takes out the dog for me sometimes. And she feeds the dog sometimes. And she gives some water to the dog sometimes. <laughs> She's my nice mom. She takes naps with me. My husband is like, I have a boy room downstairs, but it's, we painted his room and we put a bed and stuff. And put his clothes in there. He bring all, all of his clothes, so he lives with us now. So your husband sleeps downstairs? Yeah. Okay. All by self, but sometimes his friends have to come over and I do not like them. Why? Because I think they're stupid. Why? What kind but, of things do they do when your husband's well, friends come over? No. He just like mess up your room, then put a bad word it is, then my friends come over and do not mess my room, just, just play with stuff I like. Great. And I just I don't like, but I just do like them. So, well, thanks for sharing with me so much about your life as a busy mom. And a big sister, you mean? And a big sister. So, see you later, bye. Bye. Check out this video on 1600 nights on 15 hours of white. Okay. See you on the video. Okay. If you like this video, bye.